Whether working long hours at a law firm, extinguishing fires that threaten homes and businesses, or transporting offenders to court hearings, workers in law, public safety, and corrections careers play a crucial role in the well-being of their communities. Careers associated with this cluster often require specialized skills and training. Careers that require a high school diploma or equivalent include corrections officers, bailiffs, animal control workers, crossing guards, parking enforcement workers, and security guards. Jobs requiring special skills or training programs include lifeguards, ski patrol, and emergency medical technicians. Associate's degrees or certificate programs qualify workers for work as paralegals, court reporters, firefighters, police patrol officers, fire inspectors, and legal secretaries. A bachelor's degree is needed to qualify for careers such as fish and game wardens, intelligence analysts, private detectives, and probation officers. Arbitrators and mediators may qualify at the bachelor's level or need a law degree depending on the position. Several careers in this sector, such as lawyers, judges, and judicial law clerks, typically require a law degree and certification from the American Bar Association. Is a career in law, public safety, and corrections right for you? Keep these points in mind. Police officers, firefighters, and EMTs respond to emergency situations, often putting themselves in harm's way. First responders often work irregular schedules, including weekends, while part-time seasonal work is common for ski patrols, lifeguards, and other recreational safety workers. Public safety and corrections workers are often on the move, outdoors, in and out of vehicles, and in large facilities like jails and prisons. Paralegals and other legal assistants have taken on higher-skilled legal tasks in recent years, earning higher salaries and gaining skills and knowledge. Some of the fastest-growing fields in the cluster are fire inspectors, paralegals, private detectives, paramedics, lifeguards, forensic science technicians, and firefighters.